Right, back on again, leaving these lovely big tall pines. <sighs> Following the path down and down into the valley. The hill fort will be over there somewhere, but I've never been on this track, don't forget. If I have, I can't remember it. All I don't want to end up in a bog, which I will do, which you can do here. Um, if I'd stayed higher up, I would have ended up on more main tracks, you see. This could lead me into a bog. As happened to me before, I literally was, on several occasions, getting stuck in thick mud. <sighs> it is always a worry. But my theory is I'm going to come out on a track, lower down, which I would have joined anyway. But I've, this is just a different way of getting to it. It's very still here. Christmas trees. They do grow actually Christmas trees for real as well here. To sell, I think. So, exploring with Sheila, for real. Exploring for real. Yes, I'm starting to see some signs now. Aha! Seeing some signs for real. Now this is where I have to make a decision whether I go that way or carry on down. See, you can get maps with all these numbers on so you know exactly where you are. I'm going to go this way. I think. Yeah, I think I'll go this way. I've probably done this route. I've got a feeling I have been along here before. But if it starts going up, I'll be back down and I'll be going back down there. I'm doing really. If I'd stayed on the other track I would have been about there. I'm, go I'm on a parallel track but at the bottom. If I turned down there I would have gone on the lower track but I might not have done. <sighs> the hill fort would be over there okay. And eventually we'll turn off this. I didn't get that track down there. I want to get the one further up. <sighs> More hill. <sighs> you probably should have got you probably should have done that one, Chill. You've been on the track earlier. Yeah. Not to worry. Yeah, what it is, that's a wood that I've got to sort of wander through to get up to the hill fort. We'll come out at a, like a junction a bit further on. And uh, what that means is uh, you go straight on for the area of Outstanding Beauty. You're skirting the wood. Basically, I think I might have done this route once this one here um, and it's a long time ago that I did this lower track I'm normally up there weaving around in the main tracks and of course if I'd gone down there I would have been on the lower track quicker the even lower track but I did want to do this one okay so that's what we're doing it's all Christmas trees which you can see really well when you're at the top. So I'm doing a bit of weaving. 
doing a bit of ducking and diving and weaving. So find your way around. Right, over and out again. Right, so I've come on the lower path, not the very, very lower, lower, lower one. But there's a way up there, it links up with a higher path that I often do. This one links up with the lower path that we're going to do and head for the fort. I could have cheated and come out down there, but I did want to remind myself of this path. Because I did this one a long, long time ago and haven't done this, it could be 10 years since I actually walked on this particular path. Okay? In the early days it was exploring as well. But now if, say I'm doing a, usually when I'm doing the hill fort and I know I'm going to go to Cheddar, I've got a couple of sort of routes I do, one or two routes I do, just to get back. Oh yeah, look at that. Remember that? That's been there a long time, that one. Now here, when we get down here, we'll meet another junction point. We've got to walk back through that way in a minute. And then go up the fort. If you keep carrying on this way, you'll go to the area of outstanding beauty. But in a minute, we'll join up. There'll be a big sign saying Rowbarrow Warren as well, just down here. There's ways you can go, like weaving through the wood if you want. Um, see, there's a way there. There's probably, you can probably go through here and down. Let me just have a look. But this is made for the bikers. Okay? It might not necessarily take you to where I want to go. It could end up weaving it all in and out of there. So I'm heading on until I meet the next big sign, which it won't be far now. I don't know, it might be. It might be. All I know is those are the trees I have to get in to get to the fort. But we can't, you can get lost, you can get lost. Like I said, I haven't done this for a long time and the memory of it is not very good. It sort of is, because those trees have been there a long time. Oh. Oh. So, how are you doing, folks? Are you enjoying this? Is it humpy bumpy? At least it's not windy. It's not windy. You get some pretty flowers out here. Like honeysuckle, aren't they? Wild honeysuckle. All I know, when you do get near the lower areas, it can be boggy. can be boggy. Not too bad at the moment. Yeah, I remember those trees. You can smell that honeysuckle, actually. It's very sweet. It's quite potent. In a nice way. See, there's a lot of it. Mmm, it's lovely. Now you can tell we're back down in a valley now. Right? And all I need to do is sort of veer off in a minute. But I did really want to get to the main sign um, before doing that. But I think we can go this way. Now, hold on. Now, I think we've got to go up a bit further. I don't know whether to stay in the wood. No, we'll go on up here. Because that's the hill fort up there. If I'd come down earlier off those other paths, I still would have ended up on this track. I'd be walking this way. Now, I could have stayed in the wood and carried on walking on the soft grass, but no, I'll, uh, we'll make our way this way. We're on target. We might have missed the lime kiln. There's a lime kiln somewhere around here, but it could be back there. Or it might be further up. It 
So we do a little bit of this. Beyond there is the way up to the fort. Beyond those trees there. Okay. Down there is another way down to get to the fort. Which I was going to do. I was going to do this track. See there's a path just there. Which is probably softer than this one. <sighs> this one's quite lumpy and hard. I should have stayed on that one shouldn't I? I might join it again in a minute. It's not far now though. I don't know whether to get back over there. It's a bit lumpy on here. See, I would have only been there, coming along. Lots of birds twittering. Yeah, to fit everything in, you see, um, you can't do it all. You can't do it all. Do you want to go on this bit? It's softer. Let's have a look. Oh, I don't know. No, because then we miss the lime kiln. It's softer walking that than this hard stuff. Right, I'm going to turn off for a minute. Right, so I've come up that track. The other one's not far away, it's just behind these bushes here and it emerges just around the corner there. 